have you ever wondered how this is being drawn well that's why you have a key concept to simplify it for you just at your fingertips so watch to the very end and if you're new to the channel stick to the channel and enjoy the very best from LK concepts
So pin out point A1 touching each of the points on the semicircle. So pin out point A1 touching point 0 and draw a semicircle to touch the diameter and do same for each other points. done with the first part and this is the true lens The points on the apex is same as the points on the vertical line. So pin out the apex touching six prime. So touching six prime, you come to the vertical line, pin at the point, then cut her back there. Then do same thing for five prime. Pin at the apex, touching five prime. Using the distance, you pin out the point on the vertical line and draw a semicircle too. You draw a semicircle there, then do the same thing for all other sides. Lastly, pin out the apex of the hemisphere, touching zero prime. Then you come to the vertical line, pin out the point and draw a semicircle there. Then after that, you come to the circumference of the circle. So at the circle, you use any of the divisions of the, of the circle, any of them. You can use those two points that I'm using or any of your choice, any one of your choice. Then you come to the development of the hemisphere at six prime. You cut an arc on the next semicircle, which is after six prime. So you cut an arc on both sides, both right and left. Then you mark five prime. So that is five prime, and the other is five prime. So after that, you then come using that same division, the same center. You pin at five prime. Then you cut an arc on the next semicircle, on right side and also on left. So you pin at the left hand side, cut an arc on the next semicircle, then you mark 4 prime. Then do same thing for all semicircles. Using a French curve or a broom curve, anyone that's available at each of these points, you draw a curve to join each of these points together using a French curve or a broom curve.
so after that at zero prime that's the end of the curve draw a line to touch the same point of origin of where we originate uh, where we got the other semicircles so draw a straight line and after that at each of the points zero prime one prime two prime each of them we draw a straight line to meet the point of origin And this is the development of the oblique cone. So we are done with drawing the true lens and development of the oblique cone. I'm sure if you look to, you want to subscribe.